Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori, I'm fixing my collar. It's Christmas Eve day. It is about quarter to one. My family is expected to be here soon. And by that, I mean my bubble. So my niece, my brothers, and my sister-in-law should be here shortly. So I'm putting together a little meat and cheese, nothing extravagant. Their favorite pizza is this place by me. Um, it's called Cottage Pizza. So, and I just have some trail bologna. This is my favorite and I got there too late to get the plain trail bologna. So I got it with cheese, which is fine. Oh, anyway, their favorite place to get pizza is right over here by my house. So I ordered pizza for everybody, for them. I don't eat it. And so it's in the oven right now. I'm just turning the oven up to 200 and then I'll turn it off just to keep the pizza warm until everybody gets here. So I'm just putting together a little meat and cheese tray, nothing. Like I said, nothing extravagant. It's just gonna be a quiet little bit of Christmas Eve celebration. This is mostly for me, I guess, since they don't really eat it. I mean, they will, but they'll be pizza, so that's what they want. And then for the spoiled cats, guys. Hi, Dubby. And by that, I mean they're humoring me and wearing their little, um, their little cat uh, what did I make them? Handkerchiefs. I'll show you. Sorry, I'm trying to do two things at once. I went and got them their favorite food. They love Kentucky Fried Chicken in the um, grilled. I pull the skin off and I just give them a little bit of the meat. I pick it off the bone, make sure there's no problems there and then at my Amish store that I went to I got some of this dip and it is garlic and herb cream cheese spread let's taste it mmm so good so I'll put a little bit of that out Ooh, now I'm gonna turn the oven off There, pizza's warm. It'll stay warm till everybody gets here at one o'clock. And that's it. Like I said, there's just a small amount of us. So I'm not doing anything too crazy. Oh, but I will show you. I have on the stove my simmering pot. That's simmering a little much here. Let's turn it down now. And this just has um, cranberries, oranges, clove, and cinnamon sticks. And then I did put a little essential oil in here just to give it a little, a little oomph. And right now my cranberries are popping and spitting all over the place. When I went to get the food, my Christmas treat, I got some iced tea from um, Starbucks. I love their iced tea. I'm going to make coffee here in a minute. It's about 35 degrees out there. So it is, it is going between rain and snow right now. It's supposed to get like icy tonight. Um, these are going to have to go home with Sarah because we know I'm not going to eat them, right? And I thought it would be fun to bring you along a little bit with me today or tonight and tomorrow. So after here, I'll send these home with my brothers probably. After here, I will be going to Sarah's house to spend the night. And her mom, stepfather and brother are coming down. So there, there's my fanciness. I'll put it on the table and show you. I'm dreaming of a white Christmas. So pretty. 
I'm in the snow. It's snowing. No, I'm going inside because I'm cold. Hi guys, well, I did a terrible job vlogging at Christmas, but I was just enjoying my family and all that. We got some snow, I did capture that for you. We got actually a lot of snow. We had a beautiful white Christmas. It is Saturday morning, it's 11 o'clock. I just did my annual pilgrimage to the after Christmas sale at Target. I'll show you what I picked up on deals. Typically, I go for one reason, and I scored this year. Um, I just grabbed some gift tags because I ran out this year. For $1.50, you get 60 I know they have them at the Dollar Tree, but they were there, and I bought them. Then I got, I had my eye on this. Look at the colors. I love these glass Pyrex. I have one with black cats on it that I use year-round, and I will probably use this year-round as well because I don't care. It makes me happy. So it was, I have my receipt here, so everything was on Sally. Um, this was $3, and it was regularly, doesn't tell me. Why do you not tell me? Well, it was $3. I feel like they were regularly like $6.99, maybe. It was 50% off, so I guess it was $5.99. And then I got a smaller two pack with Santa and these were $2.50. I've been trying to replace my plastic with glass just because I think it's better for me. So I got some deals on those. The whole reason that I go is cat treats. This is the holiday, the boys love this. It's turkey and sweet potato flavor. 16 ounces are regularly, please hold. These are regularly $8.50, $8.49. And the boys got a couple for Christmas, but they last. I mean, this will last me six months, what I bought. I got four of these containers for $4.24. So they have these, and then Uncle Jay and Aunt Ellen got them a tub of them, and Sarah got them some. So they have plenty. I have about six of these, and this will last them you know, several months. Now, so I grabbed four of those, but when you can get that good of a deal, I try to go buy them. Um, for Luna, Sarah's dog, I picked up these are bully sticks. These are just the pork ones, and these were regularly uh, three dollars a piece, two ninety nine, and I got them for a dollar forty nine. That's really a good deal for the bully sticks, and she loves them. So I grabbed her four. And when she comes to Aunt Lordy's house, she has these treats and it's a good reward. We use these with her like at Christmas, she got a one because she loves them or on a car trip or if she's stressed out, we'll give her one, it just helps her. She likes them. And again, for that good of a deal, yes. I got some Gatorade and I got, oh, I grabbed a pack of these ornaments for $1.50. Um, they're cute, and next year I will just decorate with them. But, you know, do some crafting. The other thing I get every year, and typically I wait till they're a little deeper in the sale, but not this year. There was only two left. But the Hickory Farms um, Beef Summer Sausage, this was $4. They were 30% off. I'm okay with that. I love them. And these are zero carbohydrate. The summer sausage has sugar in it. The beef does not. So I get the beef. And then I had a 30% off cartwheel on these, which is just cheese and meat. And I love them. And I splurged because that's probably what I'll have for dinner today. <laughs> so that was everything. And then I have a 5% off my red card savings. So I spent $52.84, um, which isn't bad at all. And that's definitely, this is something I budget for and I plan for after Christmas. To, oh, sorry, I'm trying to make room here. I'm getting ready to go to Starbucks. But this is something that I plan for and budget for after Christmas shopping for the things that I know will be half price. My cats don't care if there's a Christmas bow or the dog doesn't care if there's a Christmas bow on something. They just want what it is. And for half price, yes, please. So I'm excited. I'm all set with the cat treats for the year. Well, no, about six months, I would say. 
Wellington, gosh, love him. He's my old man and he doesn't eat real good anymore. And so he loves his treats. And if that's all he'll eat, then I will give him treats all the time. You know, he's 14, born on 15. If that's what he'll eat, so be it. Oh gosh. Speaking of, I got scratched. My niece's um, dog jumped up, not her dog, not Luna, her brother's dog, Storm. She's a four month old puppy and she jumped on me and got my chin and my lip. It's okay. So I'm going to do a what my family got me for Christmas video because I get a lot of questions of, I show you all the things that I do for other people and I always get a question, do I get, do people treat me as well as I treat them? different formats but same question and yes yes they do and I wanted to share with you the thoughtful things that my family got for me for Christmas this year so we'll do that later probably this afternoon because I'm gonna go home it is 17 degrees it's chilly here in Ohio I'm gonna go to Starbucks I'm gonna go home and put all the stuff away and then I will put my fireplace on and relax all right I'll talk hi guys oh, it's Sunday morning I had to run into the office one of my coworkers got me a gift. Oh, isn't that so sweet? I love the bag. Let's see what's in here. Oh, for me, Wellington and Alex. My little babies. It's from Katie. Oh. Oh. That is so cute and it's so squishy. It's cats versus pickles and it's a kitty. I love it. She found balls for Alex. Oh my goodness. So Alex is a fussy little boy. He only likes specific balls. And she found him one. Oh, how exciting. It's a six pack. Oh, the boys are gonna be thrilled. I cannot wait to have him play with those. Oh, oh I heard something little clanky. And a cat mama with a spoon. Guys, do people know me or what? Cats, coffee, and crafts. Oh, that is so awesome. I gotta go home and send her a thank you. The boys are going to be thrilled. This is what they love. I hope he loves it as much as I do. But we're gonna take it home and let them play with it. I got some iced tea. I've got to stop drinking so much coffee. Not really. I mean, yes, I do, but am I going to? I've got crazy hair today. And I need to take out my Grinch earrings. I just love them. All right. I'm going to Costco and then home. I've got the fireplace on. Over here, I've got a Dollar Tree haul to do. Look, I found the gnomes. I'll give you a little heads up. Oh, they're so cute. But my Wellington threw up as he does. I will tell you, I picked this stuff up. This is the Resolve. I have both the spray bottle and this one. Pet Expert. This is like the foamy cleaner that you could do like big areas. And I also got the spray bottle that you just spot clean. But this is on carpet and upholstery and you spray it let it sit for 30 seconds i have a scrub brush and a towel over there and then you scrub it with the brush let it dry and then run the vacuum and it lifts it up it works fantastic for any well i don't know about other stains i usually only get pet stains but i grabbed the other one that i had of the same brand was not pet but this is for stain and odor remover so it also helps, you know, if you have cats or kittens and puppies that, you know, might potty on your floor, this stuff works great. Not sponsored, just a product that I love, and it's not that expensive. This was like $4, and it works fantastic. 
um, I'm going to try it upstairs on an old stain in my craft room and see if it gets that up that where the cat had thrown up and I didn't know and it stained my carpet. That room, the carpet was never replaced. This, this living room carpet is new. Newer. It's about four years old. Oh, and there's Mr. Wellington. He is so silly. Bubby. Hi, baby. You say hi? No. Okay. Go back to sleep. <laughs> it's only like in the 40, it's low 40s, but I'm freezing. And why not? I haven't undecorated Christmas yet. It's just Sunday. So I'll do that next weekend and decorate for winter. All right. I think I'm going to close out the vlog for the week here. Um, I did want to let you know coming up, I'm going to do a series on keto, how I got started. And then I, I set up an Amazon store, if store, if you will, it is an affiliate link, but if you click on it, it'll have all the keto items that I purchase on Amazon and I'll talk about, but we'll get into that when I start the series. It'll be after the first of the year because I have had a couple questions by a couple. I mean a lot of how to get started. So I figured we will do a let's start keto and how I started. Oh, it's so kitty. All right. I will chat with y'all later. I hope you have a fantastic Monday.